Hello everyone. Let's solve this problem very quickly. We have 1 over 2 to the power of x plus 1 over 2 to the power of x plus 1 over 2 to the power of x. And this is equal to 12. Now this is very simple. Okay. Um, okay, this is what I'm going to do. Let y be equal to 1 over 2 to the power of x. Okay, so meaning that anyway I have 1 over 2 to the power of x, I will write y. So in this place, I'm going to write y, then plus this is also y, and then this is also y. And this is equal to 12. Now I can find the value of y because y plus y plus y will give 3y which is equal to 12. And then I can divide both sides by y, um, 3 so that y will be equal to 12 divided by 3. And then from here y is equal to 4. But remember that y is equal to 1 over 2 to the power of x. And this only means that um, 1 over 2 to the power of x is equal to 4. Because y is equal to 4 and y is also equal to 1 over 2 to the power of x. Then let's work with the left hand side. Because 1 over 2 is the same then as 2 to the power of negative 1. And this will be to the power of x, which is equal to 4. Now, the next thing I'm going to do is to clear out the fraction, I mean the bracket. So I have 2 to the power of negative x, and it's equal to 4 here is 2 times 2. And then take a step further, so we have 2 to the power of x is equal to 2 to the power of 2. Now we have the same basis, and because of that, we should have the same powers, right? Meaning that minus x should be equal to 2, because the power on the right is also equal to 2. But then we are looking for x, not minus x. To remove this negative, we divide this by minus 1 and divide this by minus 1. This is because minus 1 is the coefficient of minus x, okay? This and this will cancel each other so that x will be equal to 2 divided by minus 1 and it is equal to 2. Now, let's go back into the equation and check if we are right or wrong. We have 1 over 2 to the power of x plus 1 over 2 to the power of x plus 1 over 2 to the power of x equal to 12. And now we have our x to be equal to minus 2, right? So we have 1 over 2 to the power of negative 2 plus 1 over 2 to the power of negative 2 plus 1 over 2 to the power of negative 2. Now, the first thing is to remove the negative. And when I remove the negative, I will be having, um, I, I will have to turn the, the fraction upside down. So instead of having 1 over 2, I will have 2. And this is raised to the power of 2. Remember, the negative, the negative is no longer there. Then plus, I will do the same thing here. And I have 2 to the power of 2. Plus, on the other side, for this, I will have the same thing, 2 to the power of 2. Now, will this give 12? Remember from here, it means that, um, okay, we are having 4 plus 4 plus 4. And this is giving us 12. Okay, so thank God we are very correct to say that x is equal to negative 2. Thank you very much for watching.